Hey you. All right. Welcome to season eight for real this time. So let's get into this haul. Um, if you are wondering why I'm chuckling, look at my last video that I just posted. I'm glad that's over and we're going to move forward fresh and with love and peace and forgiveness in our hearts. Okay. First up is this 87 Audi Hot Wheels. It is 102 of 250 and it's new for 2024. 73 Honda Civic and it's custom. Um, I like the 73 on there. I don't have a lot of yellow and it is 90 of 250. This green beauty, it's a custom 72 Chevy Love. It looks like one of those ones that has hydraulics, but I can't be sure. I'm actually not very well versed in cars, guys, but I love to collect them. Um, it's 118 of 250. Then I've got a matchbox that's also green and it's a 76 Volkswagen Golf GTI MK1. Now I feel like I might have a dupe of this one. If I do, I won't be returning it. I'll just <laughs> I'll just donate it, okay? Um this one is a 67 Chevy C10 and it is like a brownish color. It says keep driving and hot wheels on it. Um, it's 83 of 250. Can you see that? And you can always see the, I'm going to put these on Instagram after this so you can see it a little closer. This one is a 57 Chevy and it has these letters on it and a T at the top. So I picked it up. It's 121 of 250. And last but not least, my absolute favorite one. This is the 2024 Women's Day Roadster with three R's and it is 76 of 250. So those are my new members of the collection of the Hot Wheels and Matchbox family. Um, again, you can check those out on Instagram at deal.therapy. I do post those there under the collections tab. We've got a finally found these hair clips. I first saw these on um, Erica's Halls of More. Dollar Tree Queen 76 on IG. Um, and I want to say she showed these like six months ago and I had, I'm just now finding them. There's also a purple option that I left behind. I did get two pink and a gray, but these are great for sectioning off your hair, blow dries, braids, anything that you need to section your hair for. Um, and they usually go way more in places like Sally's and things like that. Then a couple of repurchases. I got another night lip mask because I told you guys this stuff is the bomb. Then I wanted to give you a small review. Um, this I got last summer. <laughs> I had to go all the way back to see. I didn't even have a picture of it um, because I took a break from a Dollar Tree content last summer. But this is compared to Cetaphil, the gentle skin cleanser, and it's from dry to normal skin. Can I just tell you that this is the only thing? Now, you know how much skincare we've gotten from Dollar Tree. Can't say I've tried it all, but this stuff is like this the only thing that has cleared up my like cheeks and blemishes um i was having some texture problems and some um hyperpigmentation and i've only been using this for a week and it is fantastic i know cetaphil itself is fantastic as well as cerave so i picked up two more bottles of these i only had one of the cleanser and the lotion and yes ma'am this is getting me straight so i greatly appreciate it be pure keep doing your thing we love you the Moisture Repair Conditioner by One and Only, which I believe is a Babyliss uh, company. Yes, Babyliss Pro back here. Um, and it just says phosphate and paraben free, hydrates and restores moisture, detangles and repairs damaged hair. Now it's a tiny amount, point, uh, three ounces, but that's because this stuff is like super expensive. And if you want to try it before you buy the full price that would be suggested at dollar tree um just don't try to return i'm sorry i'm i'm, I'm gonna let it go in my heart but I, i'm gonna probably make a couple more petty comments about it but apparently you need to be careful with trying to return chemical and food items or exchanging them for or against uh, food or chemical items but anyway um i've heard really good things about this and i'm excited to try it and it has argon oil in it and i picked up two and speaking of skincare we got this global beauty care this is the only um bit that i picked up from this line this is the um fresh and fruity line it's a strawberry and hyaluronic acid glowing facial moisturizer with vitamins A, C, and E. And it's meant to hydrate and boost radiance. And you get 1.7 fluid ounces. 
So a plastic um, container, but super cute. And again, this is 1.7 ounces. I want to try to get the product down in there. It's kind of like a jelly-like consistency, as you can see. Mm, it smells very strawberry-ish. Mm, I'm getting water more than anything. Um, it's quite thin. And it says hydrate and boost radiance. I feel like the back of my hand is hydrated with that, but it's it's quite thin and like watery. And again, I wish the packaging was in glass like they've been giving us. I wouldn't say like, oh my goodness, this is so hydrating. And now the back of my hand looks radiant, but hmm, give it a try if you're interested. This tinted lip balm by Be Pure. Um, it has the flower in it. Somebody had opened um one of them in the display and I liked how it looked. It just looks very sort of nondescript and inconspicuous. Um, but isn't this fun? That looks so cute. So it just has that one little suspended dry flower in there. Um, you know, plastic applicator. Sounds pretty good, but cute to put in your little purse or I think it's color changing as well. I'm clear to your unique lip color. And essentially how this science works, I think everyone ends up with some short sort of shade of pink. Um, but it might be warmer or cooler depending on your pH and your body chemistry. But something fun. This LA Colors Tropical Bloom. Um, this is in Caribbean Crush. This is from their Tropical Bloom line that they just came out with. I'll swatch it here for you. You are okay with that. I'm going to do a whole separate video. I have a whole basket full of items that I need to swatch. Oh, very nice. Like a warm, um, you know, burgundy brownish. I could see Caribbean in that. Then I got this uh, nail clipper by Sassy and Chic. These are for like those uh, faux nails that are, are quite long. You put the nail through here and press down just like at the nail salon. Uh, they did have other colors available as well. I want to say purple and black. Um, I opted for the pink. The Mother's Day line that's coming out from Be Pure. I got these hot and cold iPads. Uh, this is a pink one and then they have this sort of uh, well this is one flower option and they have a cluster of flowers here this is just the background that's blue and pink got those then I got these flower bath salts I don't need any, any more bath salts at all but um, orange blossom I did not have and I caught a whiff of it through the packaging and I was like mm. so even if you just set these out to look cute I think um you know, it's worth the pickup. And the packaging is cute as well if you're making Mother's Day baskets. These Lash Jewels by Ioni. Um, something about this tells me that it may or may not be a hazard, but I wanted to try it anyway. Um, it says, add a little sparkle to your lash strips with dazzling rhinestones and pearls. Now, some of their Ioni products already have um, rhinestones and things attached, but I thought you can use these for essentially anything, just like face jewels if you wanted, or add them to your lashes. Or just like the corners of your eyes or something like that. So I picked those up. The Jade Scalp Gua Sha Comb. Um, everyone at this point I think knows what a Gua Sha is for your serums in your face. But it actually helps to um, promote circulation and hair growth when you Gua Sha your actual scalp. So I picked these up for that reason. And especially along the lymphatic drainage points in your head. Um, and you know it's supposed to promote hair growth. So that's quite nice. Got that. These two makeup vanishing towels. Um, the oh, I've bought these many times before. The only difference is they're a purple and floral. Um, and I will pick these up every time I see them. Is in a new print because they work so well. Um, you don't even need any soap. You just need water. But I find that if you um, you know, have a lot of products on there, if you just soap it up and rinse it out, it comes right off. And then just use the plain towel to redo it so you don't have to like um wash them in the actual machine before you use it again you can just soap up your rag and all of the stuff will come off so really nice with these i got the real veggie farm double shot mask this is a coconut um i hauled the carrot and the avocado before so i just wanted to have the little trio to be honest with you body spray brazilian mist um it has notes of pistachio and salted caramel now Sol de Janeiro, that is widely popular right now um, as a hair mist, a body mist, and a perfume. 
has the same notes. What it doesn't have, what this does not have is vanilla. So it's not a note for note dupe, but it's obviously a nod to that because it literally says on the bottle, Brazilian mist. Sol de Janeiro, as you know, like Rio de Janeiro is um, a Brazilian company, or at least they are likening their products off of like the Brazilian experience in vintage years. Like I believe this one is 64. They have different ones like 40, 63, something like that. I'll try to put it on the screen here. But that goes for wildly more than $1.25. So Power Stick gave us a dupe and it smells delicious. Again, I don't get as much vanilla, but I'm definitely getting pistachio and salted caramel. And I feel like the salted caramel by nature, it gives you that vanilla scent. So I picked up three of these. They are great. Um, and I don't know if people know whether or not they're dupes or not, but it, it smells very similar. Nail Gems. Um because I don't know, I'm just in the gems. Mila Studio, they have little fruits in them. I mean, come on. Kiwi, I see an avocado, a lime, watermelon, strawberry. I don't know what that yellow one is there. Um, but yeah, so mainly blue, yellow, and purple gems, but with those fruit in there. So cute. You can use them for crafts, your nails, whatever. But this cosmetic case, it's a two-piece I'm going to try to stop buying hunks of plastic, but sometimes hunks of plastic can be extremely functional. So I got these for that reason. Travel cases, you can put whatever in here. Your sharps. Sometimes I put my sharps in like regular um, fabric bags and it will poke through. So if you have, you know, your eyebrow scissors or your tweezers or whatever kind of like sharp object, I would say put them in here instead. I think this is a good pickup, especially because they gave you two. If they would have tried to sell the little one for $1.25 or even the big one for $1.25, I'm like, nah. But this is good for two two pieces. I, I would say go ahead and pick that up. Cosmetic brush set by Be Pure. Now, what sold me on this was this little spoolie right here. I have an eyebrow pencil that has this on the other side, but there are some eyebrow pencils that do not have this. And when I say you need this when you're trying to do your eyebrows, you need it because you have to or well, at least for me, um, you know, brush your hairs up and then like down if you want to like cut them and then up again. So to shape them before you put the pencil on there. So this is really nice to have. Um, they've come out with all kinds of little mini travel cosmetic cosmetic brush sets before, but I like that this is just plain pink. Um, I like the little hardware detail on here and I thought it was a great eight piece set for $1.25 by Be Pure the cuticle oils now these have supposedly could just be shards of glass who knows who <laughs> have supposedly little um crystal crystals at the bottom and if you're new here i love stuff like this i'll just leave it at that but oh look oh my goodness i didn't know this technology was at the top so it's a little button like what you guys see that so you can press it to get it oh, instead of like like a squeezy thing. Oh my gosh. I love, I love, I didn't even know that that was like that. So you've got your oil being infused by the power of the crystal in here. Green Adventuring does one thing. Lapis Lazuli does another. Rose Quartz and Amethyst um, just off of the top of my head. This is more money oriented this is more communication and like third eye oriented this is rose quartz for love and amethyst is for like your intuition okay so all three of these will look fantastic in your little nail area placemats um that are the tropical tag so you're looking for this tag here that's usually the ones that they put out for summer and this is i forget what this leaf is called but it's colloquially known as the golden girl's leaf. <laughs> so they have this is in green as well, but I thought it was lovely in gold. So I picked him up and I also had to, of course, get the pineapple. Shout out to Pookie's view. Every time I see a pineapple, I think of her because that is her favorite fruit, I believe. And she usually has it behind her on her uh, channel. If you do not uh, know who that is or you haven't checked out her videos, please do. She has wonderful um, Dollar Tree hauls and reviews. I think this is so cute. I'm probably not going to use these as placemats, but as wall decor because I'm obsessed with 
put things on the wall. I don't know. These Ring Pop Crew Socks. I got the Sprite ones and they had a Street Fighter one that I've already gifted to my brother. Um, so I thought these were so fantastic. We keep getting all of these socks. These are by product by Textus USA Inc. Textus, can you see that there? So we usually get what well, they used to be called crazy socks and then they changed their name, but then we started getting really cool socks again. I think I'm still looking for a couple of different ones that I've seen out there. And I'm like, these are so nostalgic. Nobody needs these many pair of socks, but it's just so fun. These twisted candles, these are the ones with the flat top at the end, which I don't typically prefer, but um, we have not gotten this color before. I think they may have, may have done a pale blue for fall, if I'm not mistaken, because I know they did a yellow, a pale yellow and orange. Um, but I don't think I personally had any of these, so I picked these up. I just love these. All, all the colors for all the seasons they can give. I'll pick them up each time. Westcott glitter scissors just for my crafting needs. They're durable stainless steel blades and they're seven inches. They had other colors as well. I want to say blue, purple, and maybe a red. Um, opted for green. Then from that jewelry making display, this is Cousin DIY, which I think is so cute. 60 pieces and they're silver letter beads. So you can make jewelry with these. I will be using them for a completely different purpose, but I wanted to have them on hand. But they're essentially just letters. And these are gummy bear beads. Again, I won't be using them to make jewelry, but the colors and the fact that they're bears and they sort of look like candy and they're 100 pieces you can use these in so many diy projects finally found for me i picked up two of these um again saw on erica's halls and more um color change in party light now they have the the dot light as well i just picked up two of these in particular i won't be using them in the car i feel like somehow that's a hazard <laughs> so i'll use them in my apartment when people are over and I'm just having like a little festive situation, even for myself. I um, use LED strip lighting in my living room every single day. I'd never use the big light. So this is always like LED lights and USB lights are always gonna be up my alley. The, even the little puck push um, colored lights as well. So got these. <laughs> If you're new here, I usually collect Dollar Tree foldable fans and I had to get this one because they are cherries. Um, this also made me think of Jerrica. Um, if you are new to Erica's Halls and More channel, she has an alter ego. If you're lucky enough to catch a concert, um, don't try to buy the scalped tickets. Go ahead and get your front row ticket. When she has a performance, it's usually one night only. Catch her if she's in town. Um, I feel like she definitely needs this fan and it, it reminded me of her. I love the foldable fans and you can just pick them up anytime. I am a person who sweats. So, you know, I, I use it all year round, not even just for summer, but they usually do come out with new ones over the summer. So keep a lookout for those. Stain remover wipes. I picked up two of these. They um, end up looking like this inside the box. It's one wipe that is 4.87 inches by 6.89. So it's pretty a pretty big wipe. Um, I'm not sure how it works quite yet, but I'm sure it's good. Um, it says 12 pouches when traveling at the office or in the car. You kind of always need a stain remover wipe as an adult. Just good to have on hand. This is one of the things that I exchanged those items for, um, Libby's Diced Mango. There's just three in here. They're so good. If you put these in the freezer, you think you have yourself some sort of decadent dessert, and you don't. It's just um, diced mango, but they're delicious. August 2nd, 2024 is the expiration date on these. I picked up the air fryer parchment paper liners. I don't even have an air fryer, but I find that these are helpful even in the oven. I do plan to get one. My mom has been trying to convince me to get one for quite some time, but they're by Shore Fresh. They also do have the bigger ones that you get 15 of. These are the smaller ones that you get 20. And I got some, again, something that I exchanged those items for. Comet with lavender and bleach. Um, common is comet. If you know, you know, you ain't cleaning your tub really right unless you're getting down like this. Um, and then you have to rinse very, very well. But anyway, common is classic, um, cleaning supply. And I picked that up and this is sort of like why you should be able to return stuff. Cause sometimes 
if something is not driving with you and you really don't have a need for it, you can't, you don't want to give it away. You can't give it away. You can use other things from the same Dollar Tree that are practical and that you always will pick up. Like I'm always going to pick up aluminum foil sheets or cleaning supplies or paper plates or napkins or something like that. I shouldn't have to, um, you know, hold on and retain faulty products because of some made up um, policy. So anyway. I got these Alani's. This is in Tropsicle. They also have the mimosa. And I also picked up one of each of the prime. I usually put those things in the refrigerator right away. Of course, um, I had one out to show you. But pick these up, guys. If you're into energy drinks um, and you may be sensitive, I find that I'm not having any sort of issues with these. I'm new to the energy, energy drink world. I only ever had an excess, which you had to get from a private a business owner. So I, I never had like, I never had a Red Bull in my life. I really quite like Alani. I am an Alani girl now. Every time I see it at Dollar Tree, I will be picking it up. And in fact, I'll probably be picking up a case of regular priced Alani from like BJ's because these are really good. I don't drink them every day at all, like by far, maybe not even once a week. But when you need some extra energy and you have these on hand, they taste great. They don't hurt my stomach. I absolutely love this stuff. So pick these up. My little cousin is putting some extra efforts towards her math skills. And I found this amazing workbook that originally is $12.99. Okay. Um, it looks like we've got um, the little boy from Encanto on there. And it is math, multiply, divide, and more, reading, practice comprehension, and more, and writing, learn about nouns, verbs, and more. I mean, if you are a parent out there, please pick these up. Even if you're not, you know, I mean, all of us know, you know, kids and teachers, even this is an excellent resource. I hadn't showed um, the flashcards to you guys um, in a previous haul, but I picked up some Encanto flashcards as well. And then I got these flashcards that are Greenbrier, but these flashcards, they have made different. Um, they've made them so chic and fun, but this is addition, subtraction, uh, multiplication, and division. And look how nice they look. I mean, and then it has the Greenbrier International on there. I wish it didn't. I didn't know it had that. I wish it didn't do that. But how fun are these? So these are going to her, but also picked up for myself just to craft with colors shapes numbers letters and they are so fun they're just like those bold fun very plain um ones like they are now so shapes colors numbers and letters so i picked those up for my crafting and um i usually put like a card when i send out boxes and things like that or just like regular through the mail if i want to say something snarky and funny to somebody i love it's something different. It hits different when you get snail mail. So try that out. If you want to tell somebody you love them or you want to tell them a secret or send them an invite, put your message on like a flash card and make it official. Put it in the mail, put a, a wax seal on it, like do it up. And then it'll just be like your butt stink or something like that. It is is great. <laughs> I love to see that reaction when that happens. Okay. I got these drink pouches, but you get six pouches in, hit, in here. Um, somebody on Instagram said it's like an adult Capri Sun. Absolutely. You, I mean, you don't have to have an alcoholic drink in here, but it would be nice. And then if you went to the beach and you didn't want to take your glass bottles, you can freeze some like vodka in a plastic bottle or something, put your little mixes in both of those bottles and then put it in here. Like that would be so cool and fantastic it does come with straws as well you zip it up you stick it in the freezer and you're good to go those are going to go super fast this time i already know the tiktok girlies are on it this sense and sensibility and sea monsters book now when i saw jane austen it didn't matter what the octopus was about i was like i have to pick this up i'm seeing jane austen at dollar tree what the heck 
But apparently this is some sort of like mashup, which I think is still like kind of funny and cute. So Sense and Sensibility is by Jane Austen. We know that. But apparently Sea Monsters is by Ben H. Winters. So this book company puts them together. This book was originally $12.95 again. And it says Sense and Sensibility and Sea Monsters expands the original text of the beloved Jane Austen novel with all new scenes of giant lobsters, rampaging octopi, two-headed sea serpents, and other biological monstrosities. Okay, so they've put it together somehow. And I guess the same publisher has done a mashup between Pride and Prejudice and Zombies. So I just thought that was very interesting. Ben H. Winters is a writer based in Brooklyn. Um, and of course, Jane Austen is from the 19th century and she died in 1817. So um, I thought that was very interesting. So <laughs> I am not like really a maritime sea monster kind of girl, but I think this would be very interesting to see how they put those two stories together because Sense and Sensibility is a great story by Jane Austen. So, oh, I forgot this. The coffee shop dupe cups. Um, I don't need another cup. When I say I don't need another cup, I mean I don't need another, not nail one other cup. I am a Miyoki girl. If you are on TikTok, you know what Miyokis are. I have four of those, including the little travel mug ones. And now I have all of these ones from Dollar Tree. <laughs> I got all three of the ones from Christmas. I only picked up this white one. They have blue, they have, and a very pretty blue too. And I was tempted, okay? But I controlled myself. Blue, peach, pink and this white one now if you notice when things come in multiple colors the white one is either the most expensive or it doesn't exist because for some reason to put something for white or clear costs more money is very interesting so i opted for this one i do have the darker blue one from christmas so i was like i don't need the other blue one but that pink and that peach is fantastic all four of them really if you see them, go on and get them. Give them away for gifts. Put a gift card down in there and a lippy and you have a anytime you need it gift. Um, I just absolutely love these. They're going at TJ Maxx for like $10, other places for $10. Insane uh, um, amount. And it's double insulated. Now, I love my Miyoki because it keeps the things temperature controlled and it keeps your ice basically all day. This is not that. This is just to be cute, okay? But yeah, I think they're worth the pickup. <laughs> good deal thank you so much for watching this thank you for watching my rant if you watch that let me know what's going on in your dollar tree streets what's on your wish list what's happening in your world um during this crazy time we've got the eclipse coming up on the 8th um so you guys be careful and be extra uh, sensible out there and i will see you in the next one